Greetings, my Kung Fu compadres. This is Hong Long with Hong Long Wuja, and today we're going to do something just a little bit different. Um, I've been seeing this a lot on YouTube where people uh, uh, open boxes with faux surprise. So uh, we're going to try that today. I say fake surprise because, uh, well, you know, <laughs> I ordered the box. So <laughs> let's get to it, shall we? But before we get started, as always, if you like the video, hit the button down below, like, share to your social media pages, and subscribe. Also, hit that bell for notifications. All right, now let's get started. All right, well, look what came in the mail today. Let us see what we have here. Oh my goodness, it's a sword. Let's see what else comes in with this. Include the bag for the sword. Not too shabby. And lots of styrofoam. <laughs> oh, get the plastic off the sword too. And it comes sealed tight in the. <laughs> sealed tight in plastic. It looks like everybody's following the American way. Plastic on it, put wrap on it, box it in a box, and put it in another box. Yeah, let's see what the sword. Yeah. It's a Japanese straight sword. Like the blade, of course, it's oiled, very sharp. It's very light, balanced. I might use this for my, uh, I'll probably use this for my uh, broadsword forms. Very nice. Well, I guess that ruins the surprise of what this is. <laughs> Another sword. Plastic. This one just comes off, huh? Yeah. Yeah, this is a uh, also quite sharp, thin blade. spring still nice
Very nice. I like this one. So for those of you who didn't know, uh, I, I recently moved and before I moved I had most of my stuff in storage and it was robbed last year and uh, thieves made away with most of my uh, martial arts weapons. So I had to replace it. This one is replacing one of my uh, one of my uh, Long Chuan blades, the uh, female version. It's actually kind of cheaper, and uh, it's made a whole hell of a lot better. Fixtures are nice. It's solid. Nothing's rattling around. The scabbard is nice, although it said the scabbard was well. I guess it is. It's, they said the scabbard was well, wood, but it feels kind of plasticky. But, well, I guess it is wood. And then also along with those like along with those two I previously uh, also got this. This is also uh, this is replacing my my longer long chuan sword. Um, this blade is not spring steel. As you can see, it's not, it'll bend a little bit, but not very much. It's much heavier. This one's like four pounds, but it's very nice. Uh, I've already practiced with it quite a bit, get a, a much better workout. <laughs> and uh, it looks like these uh, probably come from the same company. This one, on the other hand, I can't remember which one is which, but uh, this one's nice too, but the uh, problem with this one is the fixtures all suck. This, this comes off, <laughs> it came off when I was uh, using it. Um, I mean, if, you, if, you, if you're a little technical, it's loose up here too. But uh, you could probably fix that with some pliers. I'm not very, uh, I'm not very good with tools and stuff. So this one will probably go up on the wall. But these others are really nice, um, and they're all under $200. Uh, two of these are under $100. Uh, I really like this one. This is going to be my new. Uh, this is going to be my new broadsword. Then in a. Um, and I'll post, uh, I'll post, uh, I'll post links in the description to these swords, and uh, you will see me using these, uh, except for this one, unless I can figure out how to fix these fixtures up. You'll be seeing me using these in my future videos. You'll be seeing me use these in future videos. All right, as always. Uh, all right, everybody. As always, thanks for watching. Um, if you liked the video don't forget to hit that button down below uh, i was pressed for time so i didn't get to go over i wanted to like do a couple of things with the swords but uh you'll see me do those later on anyway until the next time keep practicing